Yeah, you got to really soak it, soak it in, because um, all the seniors in the, in the past have told us um, how, how fast it goes, and you don't really realize it when you're um, going through the motions and um, really living it. Uh, but when it comes to the end, you, uh, it really hits you, and then you got to soak it all in. And senior night is, is at one one of the ends, but it's not the end. So um, we got a lot more to do. Yeah, what is it like for you knowing it's not the end, but you do kind of walk out of here the last time? Yeah, it's it's kind of a focus that you have to um, tell the team like this. It's senior day. It seems like the end, and it's it seems like it's uh, all going to be done. But um, we still got a lot more business to take care of. How quickly do you flush this and get ready for that? Right now, <laughs> right now, it's, um, that was kind of the message Coach Chris gave in the locker room. Um, good win, guys, but um, we got a, we got a big thing ahead of us. So. What do you think about what Chris said? Um, you heard him on the video board after the game. He said. We want to help people up there and go get our rocks. Yeah, that's what it is. We, we got a bad taste in our mouth that we're trying to get rid of. So um, we need all the, the love and support we, we can get. What was it like for you coming off that field for the last time? Yeah. Uh, game. <laughs> emotional. Um, I mean, we spent so much so much time and so much energy and blood and sweat, tears, everything. Every emotion has been laid out on that field. And then um, to step off for the last time, um, you kind of feel all those emotions over again. and. Um, just embracing it all. Was they thrown just a bunch of different things at you guys, and they kind of like yeah. felt like they emptied out the playbook. Yeah, they emptied it out early. Um, they were doing a bunch of uneven, un uneven sets and trick plays and um, grab, grab bag stuff. But um, when, it, when it when it came down to lining up and playing football, um, I think we did a good job. Did you know was it, what happened in the second half? They kind of ran out of the, the tricks yeah, and you yeah. guys were able to just take over. There? Yeah, they had a bye week. They had time to prepare and kind of uh, put those plays in, into um, into motion, but um, you can't use them all in the in the first half and then um, kind of run out. But uh, yeah, like I said, we did a good job. Yeah, off balance. I mean, unbalanced uh, formations and stuff, and then the trick plays and, and stuff like that. Okay. What allowed you guys to just that double back to the basics of the two? Yeah, when, when it came down to it, um, they were doing a lot of 12 personnel stuff and um, just lining up and running real football plays. Like, um, it, 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 um, we just did a good job at the end. You guys were so good defensively early. I mean, the numbers were fantastic. Yeah. Now, kind of come back down to earth. Are you at all concerned about your defensive team right now going into Minnesota? Uh, no, not at all. Because um, we still have the same mindset, um, the same, same nasty and stingy mindset. And as long as you have that mindset, um, no matter what you're going through, I know our guys are strong enough to persevere through um, whatever you need.